I'm Mike Sinzer, and I'm joined uh, tonight by uh, Sandy Loeffler, and uh, we're just in front of the uh, Mendham girls uh, versus uh, Jefferson game tonight. And uh, Sandy and Coldwell Banker were, were kind enough to uh, sponsor the girls game tonight, and uh, uh, we just wanted to take a few minutes, number one, to thank them, and, and also number two, to talk about some of the things that uh, Coldwell Banker is doing in, in terms of uh, various charitable uh, events in the uh, in the community. I know one of those is uh, Toys for Tots. Can you tell us a little about that, Sandy? Well, we've been doing that for, what, 20, 25 years, always with the Marine Corps Reserve, and uh, we did it again this year, and the high school and some kids from Gil St. Bernard's and Gil kids from Mendham High School always are involved in, in helping us. And the community is so generous with with every one of these collections right. that we do. They're, they just respond. Uh, it's amazing. It's really, uh, really warms your heart <laughs> to, to see how the community responds. How, how, how can the community get involved in that, or how do they donate to that? Is there is there a link to the Coldwell Banker website, or I mean, how how can people uh, yes, contribute we, to that? We always put the announcement up, and people drop uh, new unwrapped toys off at our office, and then we uh, we wait till we get a full box, and then we deliver them to the Marine Corps up at Picatinny, and, uh, and then they distribute them to hospitals, orphanages, you know, to their So is that charities. a year-long? Um, no, it's, it's, it's a, no, we do it usually in November, November. Okay. yeah, before the holidays, and um, we've been doing it for so long uh, that we have, we've seen children grow up when oh, they, they came years huh? ago right. bringing toys, and now they're teenagers bringing toys. It's really fun. Oh, that's incredible. <laughs> that's, that's really awesome. And, then, and I know you're also involved in a program at Chester, as well. Well, yes, yes. we Caldwell Banker nationally has always been involved with Habitat for Humanity. Every time we have a national conference, um, people go a week early and they do a build for Habitat in that city. And the latest one that we've done a fundraiser for here in Mendham uh, was a project on Pleasant Hill Road in Chester. It just was dedicated last night, as a matter of fact, in Chester. And it was dedicated uh, specifically for veterans. It's on Pleasant Hill Road. And I think there are three units in there. So we had uh, employees and agents who worked on it. And we raised money wow. for the project. And then we collected uh, kitchen implements and uh, bed and bath, you know, linens and things to help furnish the units. So, you know, we've... So how many units are there for there them? There are three. three. There are wow. three in this one house, and it's on Pleasant Hill Road in Chester Township. Well, that's fantastic. So how yeah. many how many uh, former servicemen are there then, or is it... It's, yes, for their families. families. There are three okay. veterans. Three families. Wow. Three veterans and their families. families. It's a three-family unit. Oh, yes, that's so. fantastic. Yeah, yeah, no, it was a great project. And a big one, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah it's a lot of work, and it, uh, it's fun when it's close to home. Yeah, yeah absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. And then, and then I guess the last thing is, I know that you guys are involved with the uh, uh, the uh, 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 Pitney Farm cleanup. Yes, yeah. um, April 25th and 26th, all the Coldwell Banker offices in New Jersey, there are 56 of them, and Rockland County, New York, are all doing a community service project on the same day. So uh, ours, we chose, we have local you know, autonomy. So we chose a cleanup project at Pitney Farm since it's now you know, owned by the township. And we're gonna be cleaning up the vegetable garden. So anybody who wants to bring your hoe, your shovel, your work gloves, and come over to Pitney Farm on the 25th or the 26th and um, of April. help us. Of April, yes, right, of exactly. April. And what, yeah, no, and, what time, and what time of the day is that? It's in the morning, 9 okay. o'clock, yeah. Okay, great. 9 o'clock, so, probably 9 to 1, you know, uh, both days. We'll probably, we'll be there. But go to our website, and we'll have, you know, the latest information posted. Great. So that's the 25th and the 26th, uh, the cleanup for Pitney Farms, and uh, 9 yeah. o'clock. And if uh, you can get out there, and even if it's just a half hour or 20 sure. minutes or 45 minutes, come on by and help out. It's a great cause. Many hands and, uh, make light work. Many hands <laughs> make light work. Gosh, that's a great saying. <laughs> It's amazing how all those sayings, they've been around for so long, and they're, and they're so true. Yeah, and, and something so else great. to watch for this right. summer is the um, the farm market coming back. It's uh, Mendham Township. Uh, they've had this farm market. It w went on for a couple of years, and then it's been sure. on. It's had a hiatus for one year. This year it's coming back, and it's coming back to Pitney Farm. So Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah. So, so, so when will that start? Do you know when that starts? I at don't all know or? for sure. sure. Probably in June, I okay. would guess. But again, you know, I'm sure there'll be a lot of publicity out for it. And, uh, 
it was so much fun before and it was just hard to find the right location. So hopefully this sounds like a good one and uh, we're excited about it because oh, we were one of the sponsors and we certainly will continue to sponsor. Oh, that's fantastic. And, you know, while I have you and, and, and just uh, uh, for a few minutes here, if we could, I, I know over the last couple of years, the market, uh, the real estate market, both in Mendham and Manchester has really uh, uh, firmed up, and I think, and yes, and, 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 mm -hmm. and it's uh, unlike in other areas, perhaps. But right. what are the trends that you're seeing, and, and, and that um, your associates are seeing at Coldwell? I think. 2014 is going to be a good year, and it's busy right now. There's a real lack of inventory. Um, we have, I think, just like 102 properties available for sale in both Mendham Borough and Mendham Township combined, which is low. I mean, usually there's, you know, 130, 100, used to be. Right. <laughs> now it's barely over 100. Right. So um, properties, are, properties for sale are very scarce, and... Uh, Hi guys. <laughs> How are we doing there, guys? Uh, some of the young fans here joining us, and yeah. uh, so stay in cheer uh, for the girls. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. But, uh, in spite of the ice and snow, people are out looking for houses. They want to live in Mendham. We've had a lot of good publicity this year for the town. Right. And um, you know, great schools here, and uh, it's 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 busy. We're climbing over snow banks and being very careful on the ice, and people sure. are still out there. We always said location, location, location. Well, today's buyers are really looking for condition, condition, condition. Interesting. They want it perfect. They want it ready, move in. <laughs> ready, move in, unpack, go to work, you know, whatever. Uh, so condition is really important. Important. As well as price and getting the right price. Uh, the buyers have a ton of information. They're all over the Internet, and they shop, 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 and then they come to us and... We try to help interpret some of all that, that information that they've gathered so right. and help them make a good decision. So it really makes sense to, uh, to consult a professional because what happens is pricing at the beginning is always so important, right? Uh, yes, because absolutely. Because you really want it priced at the right price to sell from the outset. Yes, and you need to know what's going on in the market, not right. only in your, in our area, right. but in the areas east of us and you know, and south of us, too. Right. Thank you so much for sponsoring the girls' game tonight and, and spending a few minutes with us. We really appreciate <laughs> it, and uh, it sounds like Caldwell is doing so many good things for the community, well, which is also us great. To give back to the community, and it's a pleasure. I've lived here for well since 1973. Oh, and, it's awesome! Uh, it's a wonderful place to raise. It a is family. a wonderful <laughs> place. It is. It's great stuff. So thank, <laughs> thank you so you much, so Sandy. Much. I appreciate thank it you. very much.